Fall has brought about some wonderful colors outside. It might get you thinking about the colors on the inside of your home. There are a few ways to make your home pop with autumn brilliance. Jillian Edwards from Brookfield Residential is here to show us how. Welcome. Thank you for having me. Uh, for, so we're going to start with paint. Mm -hmm. um, so how little or how much could you do with a, a fresh coat of paint? You know, it's amazing. You can do a lot with an accent wall. You don't have to end up painting an entire room. So it really depends on how much space you have, what color you're going to go with. Um, we're seeing a lot of bold trends for 2014. So if you're into the reds or something, you maybe don't want to do an entire room in right. red, or, but you want to do an accent wall, that's totally fine. Okay, so we are going to start with mm -hmm. that color. So like you said, you may not want to go um, well, you could do a whole room, I suppose, you really if you could. want to. Yeah, there's a, a variety of tones kind of in each of these colors. So this is a cayenne. It's very spicy mm -hmm. and bold, and you can see the autumn influence in it. So if you can't paint, if you're in an apartment or you don't want to commit to painting for an entire weekend, right. we've got a couple options to bring it into the room. So we've got a really cozy knit. Um, and it's so easy. You put it on your couch, you've right. got the fall color in, and when you're done, you can fold it up, put it in your closet. Or this little ottoman is great, and it just adds a pop of color into your living space. And I live for those because they have storage space know. inside, so they're all things really them. great. Okay, if you have, you know, if you're a little bit more subtle, um, you can move to sort of a gray palette. Mm -hmm. So how do you envision those paints working? So these grays are really nice, especially in a bathroom. They play off of uh, bright whites, which a lot of bathrooms mm -hmm. are. And this, to me, is the easiest update that you can find. It's right. a fresh set of towels and some porcelain accessories and, like, a new soap dispenser, and you look like you're right on trend. So it's amazing. But, you know, if you're going to get into these darker shades, you probably want to make sure that you got enough light into your bathroom right. so you don't end up with a cave of a bathroom. Yes, good idea. And the good thing is that these... They're never going to go out of style. No, right? gray is really elegant and classic, yeah. so it's an easy one to bring in and be right on trend. Okay, and uh, maybe a little bit more adventurous, moving into the yellow. Yellow. So this is kind of a mellow yellow, um, and it's great for a bedroom if you've got light, airy space. It's very calming. You see a lot of these colors mm -hmm. in spas and relaxing zones. Um, and these are actually three different shades, so there's really subtle differences in all of them. But we found some great bed sheets here um, that, you know, if you wake up in this, it's nice and sunny and happy. Or we've got some complimentary decorative boxes that you can hide all your knickknacks in, um, your cell phone, tuck everything away on your bedside table. So it's quite easy to bring those ones into your bedroom. Okay, so do as much or as little as you mm -hmm. want. And I particularly like this color palette. I know. You're wearing it today. Oh, I guess I am. I know. You <laughs> planned for this. Uh, these are the turquoises, so the the variety there is amazing. You can go from like a mint green to a more robin's egg blue. Um, and we found a really great printed pillow here that um, has a gradient kind of um, pattern mm -hmm. so that you can put it with a lot of different colors. You're not stuck with blues. Um, and it pairs really well with the wooden accent pieces that we're seeing for fall, a really beachy look, um, something that kind of reminds you of a vacation maybe <laughs> as we go into the winter time. As we start yeah. to plan our vacation. I know. That's the thing. We're going into winter now and we're spending a lot more time in our homes, so it's nice to make it cozy and inviting earlier. Mm -hmm. And then when the winter does come, we're not like, Oh no, it's snowing outside. <laughs> Are any of these um, mix and matchable? Like if you just want to maybe not go with one palette? Definitely. I think if you have a neutral, like the grays pair really easily with the reds. Right. Um, so you want to make sure that if you're doing a bright, bold color like the red, a maximum of two shades okay. per scheme, and then start adding in the neutrals mm -hmm. in the lamps and your couches and furniture. Okay, this is amazing advice. Mm -hmm. um, how can people find Brookfield if they want some help? If they want to go on <laughs> with brookfield.com or check out some of our show homes, we're using a lot of these colors in our show homes now, so they can come and see them there. Yeah, you can get some fantastic ideas. Yeah. More information and links at breakfasttelevision.ca.